Now to a breaking news update. A one-year-old taken during a carjacking near McCormick Place. CBS 2's Tara Molina live in the South Loop where that child and the car were finally found. Tara? Marie and Joe, it happened quickly. The start and finish both captured on camera. The touching moment of father reuniting with his child. The second of time captured in this photo, a palpable flurry of emotion, love, relief, a photo that says everything, holding on tight, father and son, safe, close, together again. He probably thought he was never going to see his child ever again after the, his car got taken. Stephen Eisen is a photojournalist by trade. I heard the screams, I heard the cries. And just happened to be here when the car pulled up and another took off, followed shortly by police. But capturing this. The right place, the right time. A moment he won't soon forget. Once, you know, in a you know, lifetime moments. It all happened just before one, according to Chicago police. That 51-year-old man was standing next to his car at South Loop Auto Body when the crew pulled up. The body shop caught it all on their surveillance cameras. It just happened. Yeah, it's crazy. Watch how quickly it goes down. A dark SUV pulls up. Someone jumps out and into his car, taking off with the one-year-old boy. He runs after them. Police say they sped northbound down Wabash, eventually ditching the car here on South Indiana near Cermak and taking off again. Our cameras rolling as Chicago police checked out this Audi SUV. Eisen says it's the car the crew targeted, sped off with and ditched, telling us this man got to the scene with police in a CPD cruiser. He thanked the police. He hugged the police, you know, for, for, for you know, bringing him to his child. And while the man who snapped this didn't get a chance to connect with the family he captured, he hopes this photo finds them and hopes police find the crew behind an emotional whirlwind and a very close call. Steve Eisen told us that other witnesses here were able to share more information about the crew and the car they were in with Chicago police. We've been checking in with them throughout the day. They are still investigating this. No one in custody right now. Reporting live in the South Loop, I'm Tara Molina, CBS 2 News. Close call is right, Tara. Thank you.